How can you find one single cancer cell among a billion healthy blood cells? Well, I don't have a clue. But there's someone who thinks he knows. I'm involved in very exciting research at the Faculty of Engineering where we develop new microtechnology within the medical technology areas ICET and acoustophoresis. The research field is called Lab on a Chip Technology, which means that we study what benefits you can make by reducing the analysis volumes down to microliter or even nanoliter volumes. This can be compared to taking a droplet of blood that is about 100 microliters and split it into more than 100 fractions for analysis if we're really good. Our Lab on a Chip research is focused on speeding up the way we analyze blood samples. By analyzing many parallel samples, there are evident benefits to be gained in disease diagnostics. By combining nanovials on a chip that captures different biomarkers, we are able to tailor make a chip to identify a specific disease such that we can read a pattern from the diagnostic chip that gives a more clear picture whether a patient has a disease or not, and maybe even predict the state of disease progression of the patient. An equally exciting development in our research group is our work on sorting cells in microchannels on a chip by the means of ultrasonic fields. The technology is called acoustophoresis and is based on the fact that specific cell types move at different speeds in an ultrasonic field, which is dependent on the individual acoustophysical properties of each cell type. With the help of micro and nanotechnology, we can now make microchannels that are only a fraction of a hair in cross section. A thrilling application of this research is the possibility to trace cancer cells in the blood of cancer patients for diagnostic purposes. The measurement of cancer cells in blood has recently become a standard diagnostic method, and it is used both to get an indication of the disease stage and also to monitor if the prescribed treatment is sufficient. The major challenge is to be able to detect the cancer cells in the blood who may only be present in numbers less than 10 cells per 1 billion blood cells. It is an enormous challenge to find the right cells in this jungle of healthy blood cells.